Okay, this is what I've named the here and now meditation. And I want to welcome everybody here that is on from coming on from Zoom land. And it's a rainy morning here in Minneapolis. I don't know what it's like where you are, but inside the sun is always shining. So Alvin Watts said, I have realized that the past and future are illusions that exist in the present, which is what there is and all there is. What does it actually mean to live in the present moment? How could we be living in anything but the present? Being in the present or the here and now means that we are aware and mindful of what is happening at this very moment. We are not distracted by musings on the past or worries about the future. We're centered in the here and now. We are not lamenting on either what happened in 2020, what restrictions might be ongoing in 2021, or what 2021 is gonna even bring. All of our attention is focused on the present moment. This does not mean we simply forget about what's gone before or ignore what might be waiting in the wings. It simply means we do not let those thoughts take us out of the present. As we slowly emerge from the isolation and anonymity of the last year, we may find ourselves uncomfortable, uneasy, or even anxious about interacting within a new definition of the present. One of the aims of mindfulness is to balance our thoughts of the past, present, and future. It's hard to say what the exact right balance is, but you'll know when you hit it, when you worry less, experience less stress and depression, and find yourself living the majority of your life in the present. So the intention of our meditation today is to become mindful of simply focusing and living in the present moment. We will reflect on and celebrate the past be aware of the coming changes, yet live and enjoy each and every second of the moment we are in. <clears throat> so let us begin. Find a comfortable position. You may want to place your hands in your lap or at your sides. <clears throat> Close your eyes if you wish or lower your gaze and focus on one spot. Place your feet firmly on the floor. Sit up straight, but relaxed. Now, gradually turn your attention inward, away from your surroundings, in toward yourself. Become aware of your physical self, noticing how you are feeling. Focus on your breathing. Breathe in, hold, and breathe out deeper and deeper. Continue to breathe slowly and deeply, simply observing your breaths without trying to change anything. Now let your attention move inward to the core of your body. Notice how your stomach moves in and out with each breath you take. Feel that movement in the center of your body ever so slightly moving with each breath you take. Focus completely on your core and your breathing. Notice how smooth, calm, and regular your breathing is. Allow the tension to leave your body, relaxing your muscles so that you can rest calmly and let your body relax completely. Imagine you see a door to your left. It is closed and there is a sign on the door that reads business closed. Next, imagine a door to your right. It is closed as well. And the sign on the door reads business not open yet. You wonder why these businesses are not open because you would like to see what is behind those doors. 
Now imagine turning around in a complete circle. And whenever you look, you see open doors and signs that read open for business in the present moment. And you are delighted because you don't have to wonder what is behind those doors. You are in the right moment at the right time to experience what's through the open doors. They are open and ready for you to take a step through. While you are exploring the present, you feel yourself to begin to shake loose from your fixation about what might be behind the closed doors and begin to receive a sense of excitement with being in the present moment. And what you sense is a vision of who you can dare to be and what you can dare to accomplish if you choose to focus intently on the present, always the present. You know that choosing the door to the present will show you the way to become who you already are, step by step, from one present moment to the next. You know you can trust yourself. You know you can trust the present. Each day is a new beginning, a new door to go through. Each moment is a new opportunity to let go of all that has trapped us in the past. Each moment, you can choose to be free of anxiety about the future. In the present moment, you are free. Imagine all the possibilities. Imagine what you will do. Because when you live in the moment, you are free to choose what you will do, which door you will open, moment by moment. There is no pressure, only the freedom to choose to live freely in each moment. So now choose a door and step through and find out what's new.
When you are ready, slowly open your eyes and come back to the present moment. In closing, I offer you this prayer called I Am by Helen Melacost. I was regretting the past and fearing the future. Suddenly God was speaking. My name is I Am. I waited. God continued. When you live in the past with its mistakes and regrets, it is hard. I am not there. My name is not. I was. When you live in the future with its problems and fears, that is hard. I am not there. My name is not. I will be. When you live in this moment, it is not hard. I am here. My name is I am. And so it is. Sweet spirit, you are a peacemaker, wisdom giver, and the divine one who walks beside me and lives in each of my moments. Thank you for hearing my prayer and for the answer you have already given me. I have only to open my heart to know it. Dear one, I ask for your help in keeping me from being worried, stress, or distracted by things that have already passed by and those that have yet to come. Teach me to trust in the knowledge that you will care for whatever awaits my attention so that I can stay focused on consciously living and enjoying each precious moment here and now. I am grateful for your grace and guidance as I move through this day. Thank you. And so it is. And so I say, Amen. I want to thank everybody in Zoomland for being with us today, and we will see you next time.